I'm Brendan Slave of Slave Machine Products. In our company we have approximately 100 uh, people. We have a wide variety of equipment here, uh, multi-axis mill turn machines, uh, Swiss screw machines, multiple spindles, verticals, horizontals, five axes, water jets, grinders, just about everything that uh, um, is in a healthy diet of machining. Where Spider Cool came in is, is we have, a, uh, like, I, like I mentioned, uh, quite a few verticals and horizontals where obviously a part's moving in and out on a tombstone uh, apparatus uh, and, and the coolant lines vary all over. I mean, it was, was always having constant lock line issues where, you know, the coolant would be hitting the part, to, not where the, where the cutting tool was hitting or the drill or reamer or whatever. Uh, because basically there's so much coolant flying around just about any machining process these days that how do you really, really know that it's exactly at the perfect trajectory and hitting it at the exact perfect spot? Spider Cool does just that. It, it, it takes a manual process and it turns it into a mechanical process, something that is, is programmable and perfect and repeatable every time. And what it does is it basically, you know, like a high pressure coolant system will evacuate a chip or turn a chip and a turning process from a long stringy heat holding carbide killing chip into a very small manageable heat goes out with the chip type very small milling chip. Spider Cool will do just that in the milling process. It focuses coolant exactly where you need it always without the risk of any type of human intervention after the fact, you know, causing that to be, be somehow compromised. Uh, it's been an advantageous thing for our shop because to correctly apply coolant and get the heat out of there with the cut makes everything run smoother and faster and better and more repeatable. And Spider Cool's helped us out tremendously. Uh, I mentioned we have horizontals and verticals. Uh, a good part of our uh, uh, machining uh, center is robo drills. Uh, multi-pallet robo-drills, single-pallet uh, robo-drills, and anybody who's operated robo-drills knows that robo-drills are about speed. They're a 30 taper machine that pretty much mill with the strength of a 40 taper machine, and which is why they're so widely popular just about all around the world. They're a phenomenally capable machine, but again, they're about speed. I mean, they, they index extremely fast, the tables move very fast, they're very repeatable and whatnot. Uh, the problem with normal lock lines on a robo drill is because they bang around so quickly, lock lines are more, more capable of being moved on those machines than just about anywhere else. That is where we initially chose to put Spider Cool because, again, the there are so many tools coming in and out so fast, long drills, short drills, uh, that the Spider Cool was an absolute natural for a machine like that. Uh, and also because when pallets are moving in and out, there's more, more of a chance of a guy misloading something or, or on, on, a, on a hand loading non pallet, uh, non multiple pallet machine. A guy will go in and place it apart, and there's lock lines everywhere. Basically, Spider Cool eliminated that because it's mounted to the back of the machine, rear and out of the way when the pallet would exit. Um, you, you put your parts right in the pallet right there. There's no lock lines anywhere close to it. And again, it's all, the same reason it works so wonderfully on, on a horizontal application. It's all programmable. Program it once, up and down you go. Eight inch drill down to a half inch boring bar. You will hit the tip of that tool every single time on a robo drill. It's, uh, it, it's an absolute natural for a robo drill, uh, I think. I think it's the most integral part of, of it. Again, the, the, the correct application of coolant. Is, is critical to any manufacturing process. And what Spider Cool does is it allows you to do just that. Perfectly apply the coolant exactly where it's needed. My name is Nick. I'm a CNC foreman for a slave machine. I've been with the company for 21 years. And um, lately, we stumbled on uh, Spider Cool. Um, the Spider Cool is a very good addition to our robo drills. Um, the reason why it's for uh, speed. We're looking for speed and uh, uh, cycle time. Um, in Spider Cool, what it does to us is, is a quick little setup with just a touch, a couple of buttons, uh, sets those uh, coolant line right to the to, to the tool, right to the to, uh, to the part, and help us out uh, with our uh, uh, cycle time. And uh, we don't have to have the operator go and open the door and uh, keep adjusting the the coolant line. And uh, we have an uh, increase in our uh, production. And that's what's uh, what's all about nowadays. Uh, all about spindle turning, and making money. And Spider Cool will give this to us. Uh, we have a uh, five robot drills, as I uh, mentioned it, and uh, we put it ourselves in uh, in place. And um, well, the first time it was a learning curve. It took about four hours, and the other four, uh, within five hours, we put them all on in place. It's a very excellent kit. It comes out with all the instruction. 
It's very uh, soft, usable, and um, easy to put it together. And like I say, with no time, the first time you do it, it's going to take a little bit, but the second time, it goes very easy. Um, we really like it, and they're very dependable. Uh, we have about now two years uh, we've been dealing with the spider cool, and uh, not once we had a call the, the, for a repair or for down time, or uh, we just keep repeating and keeping good production for us. So they're very reliable tool for us.